me, all right? Knock it off! I mean, you can say whatever you want. Skip can say whatever he wants, but Skip, whenever you refer to me, whenever you speak to me, whenever you address me, address, address me as all pro Stanford graduate, because those are some accomplishments you'll never, you can aspire to, you will never accomplish. You have never accomplished anything. So, but um, those things are on my resume. Those are, those are what I've done. It's my second year in the NFL, going on my third. I mean, you tell me who's wrong. Okay, I, I'll accept that. I, I think I've accomplished more in my field than you have in yours, though you're just getting started. So, so I'm, I'm the top of my field, so I'm all pro. I'm the best, one okay. of the best 22 players in the NFL. You're, you're going to brush it off, but I don't think you're the best 22 anything in sports and in, in media and well, anything. I think you debatable. think more of yourself than you actually can, you know, prove. But okay, I'll, you think you're like better than Darrell like Revis is right now? In my, in my 24 years of life, I'm better at life than you. Okay. So let's, All right, that's let's, fair. Let, let's All get, right. let's get down right. well, to let's, let's stay. Cast. Let's not get personal here. I know you said you, you were thankful for the organization to have you back. Is there anything you have to show to the fans, you have to prove to the fans, to, for them to welcome you back this year? There was a lot of people upset uh, with the way things went down in the offseason. Didn't I just tell you don't ask me that? Yeah, but, you know. You at the conclusion. Turn around. Go back. Go you. back that way. Bye. See you. you Next it. question. That's his last interview for the year. See y'all later. <laughs> Don't come over here no more for the rest of the year. Says that you have come here, I want to see your face when you ask me this question and the way you're going to ask it. I know you're going to ask it in a way that's just more of a division and more of a negative way than what it was. All right, so come here, I want to see your face. Please, part so I can see your face. If you are a responsible journalist and look me in the eye ask me this question, please. The way that, that, um, that you want to ask it, come here. Look a man in the eye before you try to kill him or make up something. Look him in the eye. Plaxico okay? says you haven't spoken with him about your comments on WFAN. Is that true? I haven't spoken to you about him. Have you spoken I've with spoken him? I've spoken to Plexico. I spoke to Plexico in the team meeting as well. Did you do it do you think one before play your by comments Plexico or after? Plexico lost us the game? No. You think interception by Eli lost us the game? No. You think a tackle by Kiwanuka lost us the game? No. Is that what I expressed to the team? Yes. Those things didn't lose us the game. But the fact of the matter is we're six and five. We lost three games in a row. What do you want us to do? Put our heads down and go into a corner? We don't do that. We're men. We get back. We practice hard. We prepare to play to win. Don't prepare to come in and have someone who wants to take a comment and try to divide teammates in a way that it just disrupts this team because we don't have that division here. So if you want to come here with the negative, you're coming to the wrong guy because I'm not a negative guy. I don't kill my teammates. I'm a man, and I talk to my teammates. So if you're going to talk to me, don't stand in the back behind 10 other people. You come here and you look me in the eye. And when you look me in the eye, you ask me a question. Ask me a question in the appropriate manner. If you're going to ask Plexico about something, you ask him in the appropriate way. Not the negative way as it seems like I'm attacking my teammate because I don't do that. I know you take a lot of pride in seeing your receivers play well. Devin Funches has seemed to really embrace the physicality of his routes and, and making, getting those extra yards. Does that give you... A little bit of an enjoyment to see him kind of truck sticking people out there. It's funny to hear a female talk about routes. Like Late in the game, uh, the cameras, as you'll see here on the sidelines, catch a picture of Derek Anderson, the quarterback, and, and Deuce Latouille alignment, and there, there's a smile on his face. And afterwards, a reporter asked, what's so funny? What, what were you saying in that instance that you were trying to be positive that was funny? And I, I don't mean this to be sarcastic or, or pointed, but I mean, that went out on Monday Night Television. A lot of fans are talking about it right now as a big problem with this team. Can you put it in context what was going on at that moment? What caused you? What Deuce and I talk about is nobody else's business. But why was something funny when you're down 18 points in the fourth quarter? It wasn't It wasn't funny. I wasn't laughing about anything. The camera showed you laughing. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. You commented about it. That's fine. That's fine. I'm not laughing about it. You think this is funny? I take the Serious. I'm not I'm real serious. I, I put my heart and soul into this every single week. All I'm saying is the camera shows. I'm just telling you right now what I do every single week. Every single week, I put my freaking heart and soul into this. I study my off. I don't go out there and laugh. It's not funny to me. I don't want to go out there and get embarrassed on Monday Night Football in front of everybody. That's why I'm asking you. What I'm telling you right now. We're not. We're talking. Deuce and I are talking. What was the context? I'm done. Sorry.
Yeah, I'll talk to you this week. Well, well, you're well, well you, you were injured all year. What have you done for us Sorry. to talk to you about all year? Okay. I, I talked to you Tuesday. You, what, just don't, don't just talk. Don't say you're not talking because I didn't talk to you all year. You were also injured most of the season too. Hold on, just relax. Can I go to my family that I have outside? And you all can. Of a sudden now? Just, just don't say we didn't talk to you we, all year. We just wanted to ask for your perspective on what happened you, there. You're involved in one of the biggest plays of the game. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Jim. I appreciate That's your all. time. We do. We won't hold you. We, we would have talked to you in the season, but okay, also let's, you were let's injured. Ask a Just tell us what occurred on the, on the plane. Miscommunication, that's all it was on my part. I take complete fault for that. Did, did was it a know? fake? I don't know. It was complete fault. My fault. That's it. Did, Is this something the team hasn't practiced? It's all me. All of me. That's uh, something I did wrong, and that's all. So you were It was aware. all on me. Yep, number 25 out there. That was me. Um, I was the one that did it. But were you aware it was, that it was just a fake? Me. Yeah, I, I messed up. I understand that, but I'm just asking if you knew it was I messed up. We just didn't know if it was a communication Yeah, breakdown. I messed up. Thank you. Okay. Yep. Thank, Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thanks. Start this, this thing off. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and say this. I think I said some a couple weeks ago. Look, I got fined $25,000 for not talking to you all. And uh, me personally, I really don't care. But at the same time, I do, ask, I do ask questions. I mean, answer questions throughout the week. But for the league to find me $25,000, I'm not going to answer any more questions for the rest of this year. If it's going to be uh, an interview, I'm going to conduct it. So I'll answer my own questions, ask myself the questions, then give y'all the answers. So from here on out, I'm not answering any more questions. Hey. Um, it's, it's, it's not difficult to do your research, um, but he's, I, I obviously do. Um, in which way was I incorrect? Uh, it's a little different. It's a little different. I don't work for Brandon Brown. You, you don't have anything else? But you, you never answered my you never you never go on with our discussion. You never you never concluded that. So I don't work for Brandon Bowner, so the point is invalid. Well, it's not invalid. The commissioner of the NFL also takes the entire NFL. There's only thirty two owners hanging out with the owner doesn't need that propriety. Just like you hang out with the competitors of Super Bowl, what's the example? I don't work for my I don't work for the competitors. But again, I don't I don't get to impose discipline on the competitors. How many, how many other owners has he, has he hung out with? Have he, has he been to the house to take pictures with? Uh, have you done your research? No, you haven't. You just said that. You just came off knee jerk and said that. Come on. You Come on, be more specific. Come on, do your research. Be more specific. So, so did all these people defend him in the Ray Rice deal, or was it Robert Kraft? Uh, did, was was it? Come, come on, come on. Who was the first person to say anything? Who was the first person to call Roger Goodell? Come on, give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. You're not doing your, you're not doing your research. Uh, you, you. It's difficult to have a discussion with someone who has no information. You don't have any information. I have all the research, but I'm giving, I'm doing your job for you. And if you're making it difficult to have a discussion because this, I'm not leaving. I'm, I'm doing my research. Did, was he the first person that called Roger Goodell to s talk about the Ray Rice situation, or wasn't? He oh, he wasn't. He wasn't. Oh, he wasn't. Do you, do you know that? Did you do your research? Did, did you do your research? Come on. Did you, did you do your research? Did you do your research? Did you do your research? Come on, come on. It's it's difficult. It's difficult. I wish I wish this would be a better debate, but it's not. It's it's the levels aren't there for us. Get a couple more, Marcus. Marcus are you totally healthy? Huh? Are you totally? Why are you healthy? asking me that? Well, because I'm wondering. You early in the year you were you had an ankle problem. How long ago that was? No, no, no. See, we asking the question. See, don't get mad at me when no, I ask no, you a question. No, no, no. See, I'm asking you. See, I'm asking you a question now. You feel me? It was early in the year. That was like seven weeks ago. Okay. I'm healthy now, man. You know, things happen like that. You know. But nah, I didn't. I don't mean nothing by asking you that back. I'm just saying, don't ask nothing that that, that makes totally sense. If I wasn't healthy, coach wouldn't have me out there. Like I said, I've had a bad couple of weeks. You feel me? I owned up to that and I step up, man. I know I'm a, I'm a top fucking corner in this league, and I ain't been playing like it.
Marcus, you last one. Can I'll you put that on me. You can, can you? Brand new caddy. caddy.